Hey guys, it's Mike and I'm back with another video. I uh, just wanted to f uh, just showcase um, or recap rather my day at the Westchester uh, County Sports Card Show today in White Plains, New York. Um, it was a fantastic time, man. I had a blast. Got to meet a bunch of the YouTuber fellow YouTubers. Um, off the top of my head, Mike Yo. Got to meet him. Got to be actually in one of his videos. Uh, great, great guy. Um, got to meet Victor Negron. Ted from Serenity Sports, some of excuse me, Serenity Sports 50 plus, real tongue twister there. Uh, Ed from Wester Griff, uh, Super 25 Sports Cards. Bob, my main man, uh, got to meet the Godfather, Ricky Russo, and he gave me this Halliburton over here, where I can actually put some cards in, which I have a couple of ideas of what I'm going to put in here. Also, the fact that I am a wrestling fan, so I know how to use a Halliburton, so. Keep in mind if you guys try to steal my sports cards. All right. So anyway, I'm going to try to put the links down below to follow their videos. And I managed to pick up a lot of cards today. Um, and I didn't even break the bank on the, on these cards. Um, I didn't really get a lot of special cards. A lot of these are just base. Um, a couple of inserts, some refractors. Um, only one autograph card no and no game used. Um, kept it simple, tried to just fill some holes in the PCs. Um, so, without further ado, I don't want to make this a 25 minute video. So, let's get crack a lacking, as my boy Jack Frost would say, or something like that. Uh, picked up this select Derek Rose. It looks like it's a Cephia kind of refractor thing going on there uh, for my next PC. So, I picked up that. Picked up this 2016 um, 17. Uh, Carmelo Anthony from Select. This is also from 2016, 2017, and probably a, I'm guessing it's a parallel, but there's the back is different from there's no stats in the back on this one. It's just a little bit of writing up on Carmelo, but so I'm guessing it's an insert ish. I don't know. Got this from I want to say 2011, no, 2012, 2013. Innovation, um, mellow, mellow. Unfortunately, mellow will probably be taking his act elsewhere this summer. Thank you, Phil Jackson, for that. Check this gorgeous card out, man. Look at that. I, I you know, what? I know it's not called an X Fractor or, or anything like that, but this thing is gorgeous, man. You have three colors in the middle there. It's like a turquoise. The, then you got the silver and the red, and then you got the, the the magic happening on this. So I saw this card and I just had to have it. And I picked this one up over from Derek from above uh, Eric. I'm sorry, Derek Rose. And again, you got the refractor thing going on. I want to see it's like a uh, red a red refractor. I don't know what it is. It's not numbered though. But this thing is badass, and I had to have it once I saw it. So I picked that up, and then for the Jets PC, grabbed me, a, or for the Joe Namath PC, grabbed me a Namath Prism. Also a Namath Select, which will go in the Namath Binders. Then going into the Jets Binder, I've grabbed the John Riggins Select. Grabbed a, my, fam my favorite Martin, Curtis Martin uh, Select card for the Martin PC, going in the Martin Binder. And now onto the Yankees. Grab this. Um, commemorative chromes Masahiro Tanaka nice Tanakas grab this Dellen Patances from the same set insert set this one I think is a refractor so you can see all the colors of the rainbow there whereas with the Tanaka you well maybe you did you could I just probably didn't have it have it the light or it's a chrome card anyway it's I don't maybe it's not a refractor maybe it's just a regular chrome I don't know it's then I grabbed these three Topps Tributes. Mr. Andy Pettit, one of the best post-game pitchers you'll ever have. Catfish Hunter. And the chairman of the board, Whitey Ford, all going in the Yankee PC. Uh, going in to fill up some holes in the vintage Yankee PC. Uh, Ron Woods from the 1970s top set. Um, Steve Hamilton from the 1970 top sets. For the 1965 tops, uh, Johnny Keane. Funny story, funny thing is that he was managing the Cardinals 
in the against the Yankees in the '64 series. The Yankees lost that series to the Cardinals in seven, and the Yankees decided, well, Yogi Berra wasn't good enough to manage the Yankees, so they fired him and hired this guy, and he did no better with the Yankees. Actually, did worse. He finished like third, fourth, I think I want to say in '65. Uh, '65, rather. I'm sorry. Uh, 1960 Duke Moscard. Got a great picture of the old stadium behind him. That's that's awesome. And I got, of course, had to pick up some Jeters. I was picking up other cards, and as I was walking away, it's like, you know what? I had enough. I'm not going to spend no more money. I'm going to walk away. Walk away. I see this card. I saw a bunch of cards that said uh, I had a Jeter, or two, uh, Jared Jeter's two for a dollar. And I was like, it's like the Mafia. It's like the old line from The Godfather 3. Every time I try to get out, they pull me back in. So... Here I am, pouring through this Jeter box, getting some Jeter cards I don't have. Uh, got a Topps opening day Jeter, 2010. I think of what that was. And you have a, a Golden Greats Jeter, which I didn't have. Uh, Don Rust Elite Generations insert of Jeter. Uh, and then we have a Fleer National Trading Card Day Jeter that I didn't have. I'm hoping I don't have all these. I don't think I do. Sports Illustrated Derek Jeter. So I still have these in the penny sleeve, so that's why there's still kind of a flash on these. Um, this is the Topps Diamond Anniversary Card, I think, of Derek Jeter. We got a, um, this one's supposed to look like the 1973 tops, I think. There's no, there are 70, yeah, the 73 tops, I believe. This was supposed to be the 73. No, it wasn't the 73. Oh, I'm so tired, I can't even remember what year this card was supposed to be based off of. But there's the Jared Jeter one of that. Make myself look real stupid. And I'm tomorrow, after I turn off the video, I'm going to know exactly what year that card was. Um, Panini Classics, Derek Jeter. Stars of Summer insert. Classics 2014's October Heroes Derek Jeter insert. Kind of badass there, like that red cloud behind him. Look at the shine on this bad boy. Second season standouts. From Bumper Deck MVP. Uh, that is nice. <coughs> uh, Fleer inserts, headliners. Jeter Jacks one. Um, and we have another Sports Illustrated Fleer card of Derek Jeter. Moving along, we got a hit Don Russ, a hit list Don Russ uh, insert. Um, another Classics Derek Jeter. I believe this is the base card of that year. A Green Border Victory Derek Jeter. And we got a trio of all-stars with J Jeter, A-Rod, and Mariano. This was from the Yankee Stadium Legacy stuff, the retail set. And finally for the Jeter PC, this big Mamma Jamba. Hometown Heroes of Bernie and Jeter. I gotta figure out how I'm going to stick that in a binder. I think I'm going to have to buy one of those large one-sheet binder pages. Okie dokie, moving along. For the Reggie PC, grab this Bowman Chrome MLB draft history of, from uh, the Kansas City Athletics. This 1974 American League playoffs, A's, uh, A's versus the Orioles card. 1975, Reggie versus the A's, no, versus the Dodgers, I'm sorry. The Oakland versus the Dodgers card. Uh, 1975 Reggie Jackson base cards in terrible shape, but for what I for a dollar, it's going in the binder anyway. Until I find an up get it, until I find an upgrade on that. This one I had never seen before. This is I believe 1982. Looks like a tops card. That might have been stuck in like a hot rod magazine or popular hot rodding, but it's Reggie Jackson with a uh, pretty sweet ride there. One into cars, but that's a pretty badass card. Car, rather. 
And from 78 tops, uh, Reggie and the Yankees reign World Series. Uh, for the Roberto Clemente PC, picked up this um, Diamond Kings Roberto Clemente. And this is another Roberto Clemente card. Here it is. It's stuck in the other pack. F pile, rather. Um, from 75. 1966 Most Valuable Players of Frank Robinson and Roberto Clemente. So that's going in the Roberto Clemente binder. Huh. Actually, there's another Jeter card here that kind of slipped out. A UD3 card of Jeter. The Establishment. Or did it say Enshrinement? I... Come on, you... Oh, the Establishment. I had it right the first time. Okay, for the Hall of Fame binder, got this 1982 Johnny Bench tops card. And for the 82 tops is Michael Jack Schmidt card. And this these are some of my favorites that I picked up. Or actually, Mike O gave this to me. I got starting off the YouTube PC, autograph PC. So now I'm gonna have to go after all you other YouTubers. This one's a great one. I like this one. It's my one of them. Might be my favorite. And this bad boy. And this is also gonna go into the. Is this from the packs that I broke on um, Michael's channel of uh, Don Rusk, uh, Diamond Kings? Um, oh, Grover Cleveland Alexander will go in the Hall of Fame binder. Ty Cobb will go in the Hall of Fame binder. Nelly Fox will go in the Hall of Fame binder. And then you got Albert Pujols. Gotta check to see if Max Carey's a Hall of Famer. I don't think he is, but I could be wrong. I'll check in on that and see if he is. If he is, he'll go in the Hall of Fame binder. Christian Yelich. Rio Ruiz, rookie card. And Jose Altuve. And some more of my other favorites. I picked up this 1960s Casey Stengel for a steal. Maybe it's the condition. Get some dog ears going on here. Um, I don't care. It's going in my Yankee Binder collection. I needed this card for the 60 set. Uh, Wester Griff gifted me this card. Uh, Bowman's Best Gary Sanchez. Lo love this card. Thank you so much for that, Ed. I appreciate that. And finally, my pickup from from Ricky Russo. Bought this for a deal. Five star on card. Silver ink. Paul O'Neill autograph. That bad boy is number two. 25 out of 25. Wow, it's an eBay 101. Did not realize that. And it's already been sold to me in a magnetic, which I certainly appreciate. Ricky, thank you for the sale on this. This is going to be a permanent, permanent um, member of my Yankees PC. So I really appreciate that. So, guys, that was the, the uh, haul from... Uh, from the uh, card show today, I want to thank the guys that I met again off the top, off the top of my head: Mike Yo, uh, Ricky Russo, Wister Griff, Ed, Victor Negron, uh, Ted from Serenity Sports Fifty Plus, um, Bob from Super Twenty Five Sports Cards. Uh, you guys were great, man. Thanks a lot for hanging, for letting me hang out with you guys for a little bit today. Um, hopefully, next time, uh, the next show, we'll get to hang out a lot longer. Um, so, anyway, guys. That's time to go to bed. I am beat. So thanks for watching the video. Please comment, subscribe if you haven't subscribed already. Uh, like the video if you like it. Uh, give it a thumbs up. Um, and again, thank you so much for watching the video, guys. Have a great night.